Hi everyone, welcome to Creatively Gracious. If you're new here, thanks so much for stopping by. And if you're returning, thanks so much for coming back. I really do appreciate each and every one of you stopping by and spending some time with me today. So today we're doing a plan with me in my dashboard planner and I pulled out the seasons and holidays sticker book. This is from Craftsmart. So this was a Michael sticker book. And then I also have Posh Faves and it is Cinco de Mayo week. So I thought I would do a spread with Cinco de Mayo and that's what I'm planning to do. This one has some really cute Cinco de Mayo stickers in here. So I figured I would use these and because I am trying to use my stash, I figured it would be great to use these. So that's another reason. So let me get these out of the way. And then over here, I had these extra florals. I had used them in a spread before and I thought the color combination goes well with it. So I'm gonna use these few florals that I have here. I'm just gonna tear them out. And I don't know if I'll pull anything else in, whoops, but this is my plan so far. I have a piece of wax paper here. I'm just going to go ahead and take these out because I know I'm going to use all three of these. So let me grab them and see where I want to put them. I used the rest of these for a different plan with me. I don't remember. I think it was, I don't remember. Maybe it was last year sometime. But since I had these left, I figured I would go ahead and use them for the spread, especially when I saw that the colors went really well with, with this sticker book that I have here. So I don't want to cover up May, but I'm trying to figure out where I want this big sticker. That one would look cute there. Yeah, I think this one I'm going to sit right here. Well, let's, let's see. Let's see what we can do with this. So let's go to this side first. I know I do want to use these three here and I'm going to figure out how to do that. Well, Cinco de Mayo happens to be right here. So I guess I'll pull this, this one in and put it over here. We'll start there. And I'm just going to set it on the wax paper. Do I want to set it here? No, it's too big there. So I'm going to set it all the way down here. Let's see if we can get this a little bit straight. Yeah, that looks good. So there's that. And then I think I will bring this floral and set it over here. Or I could put it in the middle there. Let's, let's decide. This says Happy Cinco de Mayo. So I think I can pull that in. Let's see if I can grab it with this. Sometimes I tear these stickers. Okay. So this is Happy Cinco de Mayo. So I'm trying to figure out, maybe I can put that up here. Yeah, let's do that. And I thought this was a really cute um, set of stickers. I hadn't used it. I've had this book for a, a long time. And sometimes I actually forget to decorate for Cinco de Mayo, but um, I saw someone talking about um, Creative Karma Design. I saw her one of her videos and she was talking about me the fourth be with you and that's what reminded me that it's cinco de mayo week sometimes i'm bad about decorating for the specific holidays so she's the one that reminded me because she said may the fourth and i was like oh yeah cinco de mayo week <laughs> so i know she used some little star wars um mandalorians in her video and it came out really cute so i was watching that and that's what just reminded me that it is Cinco de Mayo week. And a fun fact about me, I don't know if I've shared this fact, fact before, but a fun fact about me is I was in a ballet folklorico. So that's the dancers with the big dresses. So every Cinco de Mayo, we were busy from sunrise to sundown and sometimes even later because we would go to the different places and perform and dance. And I danced from the age of seven all the way up until I was 23. I actually was pregnant at the time. I think I was like five, six months pregnant when I finally stopped, stopped um, dancing. And I do miss it, especially like during this time, I do miss, miss dancing and just going out and just performing for everyone. It was so nice. Well, at the time, I guess I did get tired of it. I shouldn't say it was so nice because sometimes I would be, be like, oh, I don't want to do it this time. I don't want to go today. 
but it always worked out so ooh, it was it was a fun time and i met a lot of different people doing that too which was nice some of them i still stay in contact with i haven't talked to some of them but they're they became kind of like family so i think these i'm gonna set up here and i'm gonna kind of angle them like this and then maybe one of these floors i think this big floral i might take to the other side i think i'm gonna set them here yeah let's do that i think that looks cute so i'm gonna have to white out these these things here if i set it like this i may have to white out that one too well oh, i didn't oh no i had it here okay let's do that we're gonna set it just like that and then we'll kind of do a string of um, we'll we'll make a string with it with the uh, with the pin i think that will look cute i'm not going to set them down because i'm going to make sure that i have them right at the right angle i i just want to angle them before I put them down yeah i think that looks cute we'll set them like that and then I'll just get my pin and I will kind of do like a little, like a little, um, strand here just to connect them. That looks cute. And now I'm wondering if I should have moved this big floral to the bottom. Let's see if I can get it up. Oops. Whoopsie. Whoopsie. Let's see. Well, it came up pretty good only because I put it on the wax paper. <laughs> Otherwise, I think it would have stuck. Now, I think maybe I could put this right here in the middle. Yeah, let's do that. It's different. Uh, didn't I cut a piece off of this? I did. It was this piece here. No, I guess I didn't. I'm going to set it like this. I think that's really pretty. Okay, we're going to set that there instead. I think it looks better there. It looked kind of weird there now that I put that banner up at the top. Oops. Okay, so now let's go to this side. I think this red one, where can I put it? Maybe I'll set it like this. I think it goes really good right here. I was thinking about cutting it, but I think I like how big it is. So I'll leave it like that. I'm just going to cut this edge down here. Okay. No, oh, that one's popping up. Oh, this is looking so cute. I like it. And then we have these, these uh, boxes here. They have little uh sayings on them but i'm gonna go ahead and throw them in here because i'm gonna put one there no i'll probably have to put one there and then one over here because i have that one there okay let's do that we're gonna set this one right here there and then i'll bring this one i didn't pull any other boxes though i didn't think about that so I think I'll, yeah, I'm going to bring this one to here. Let's see if I can lift this up just a tad bit. I need to grab some more boxes because I did not think about that. I thought I was going to have enough with, with this thing here. And that says menu planning and that says party planning. I'm just going to leave it. I'm just going to disregard it for this week because I think it's fun to use it. And just have it there so this says salud so it's like a toast i'm going to bring that and put it to the this side over here oh what happened here let me cut this because it came with it okay and oh this would let's put it down here hmm now I'm trying to figure out where. No, I'm going to set it right here. I need to leave a space for my videos. So maybe this time I will leave this spot for my videos. I'm going to put this right here. Ooh, that looks so cute. I'm going to cover this up. 
it says bills to pay because this is an older planner that's why it says bills to pay. i i was also thinking of bringing in this sticker pack because there's a girl in here that i love to use all the time i used her many of years well probably two years ago i think i'm going to bring her in and put her in here because she just goes really well i need some more of these uh stickers oh i have some more and the funny thing is the wrong wrong came out with another latina book and i don't know why i don't have that one i should have that one but i don't so i think her i'm gonna set her maybe do i want her there or do i want her on the other side i think she's really pretty Maybe I can put her right here just to give that box some accent. Okay, we're gonna we're gonna think about that because we still have a lot to do with this spread. I like this. It says holy guacamole, and then this says piñata. So I'm gonna pull that in. I gotta figure out what I'm. I need. I think I need some more boxes. And do I have? I have the Live Love Posh, the red. I could pull in some of these because they would work, but I think I'm gonna have to bring some other boxes in too. So let me grab another sticker book real quick. Okay, I pulled out this Agenda 52 Borders uh, foiled, and I think I'm gonna use this one because it has a lot of the colors, like it has the purple. It has the purple, so we'll bring that in. And then it does have orange too. So here's another purple and it has pink. And I don't know if this pink is too light. Let's see what we can bring. Let's bring this orange in. Or maybe I need this one. Well, I might bring both of those in, let's see. And over here, I think I'm gonna bring this one says memo. I think I'm going to put it over here because this is where I'm going to do my videos. So I'll put that there. Oh, that looks pretty. Yeah, this actually goes perfect with it. The colors are really, really good. We have green too. So let's see what other boxes we have in green. I have used this sticker book a lot. It's actually a really good sticker book. I like this little one um, because it has so many colors in here. Let's see about this pink. Is this pink too light? No, it actually works well. So maybe I will bring the pink in. I just need to decide which one. Maybe this one. Let's try it. Bring some different shapes in this time around. Okay, let's try that for now. I may need some red boxes too, maybe a few. So I will grab some from here. Maybe one like this. Okay, let's try that for now and then we'll come back to these boxes because I think this is coming out really cute. So maybe this one I'll bring. Let's put this one here with this. It's kind of orange and orange, though. I don't know if I wanted that, but I guess it's going to stay like that. And we'll bring the green one in over here. It's a little bit darker green, but I think it'll work. We'll just set it right here. Okay, that looks cute. And I still got to decide where I want to put this girl. I think she looks really pretty right here, but now I just put that green box. Maybe I'll set her right here. Yeah, let's do that. Let's put her here. Oh yeah, that's really pretty. And then we have Holy Guacamole. I do want to put that in here somewhere. I think I'm going to wipe this one out so that I can set it right here. That looks cute. Okay, that was cute. And then we have these stickers here. So I got to figure out where I want to put them. Maybe I will bring this box sticker here. And 
this red is really dark. Well, it is the same color. There's the red up there, but I'll set this one here like this. Oh, I was going to use that for my videos though. Do I want it like that? Maybe I'll set it like this. Should I set it like that? If I do, I think I need to pull this up. Okay, that looks cute. We'll leave it like that. And now I think we're just going to finish adding these little decors. I didn't get any bullet points. Let's see if this book has bullet points. It may. Oh, these are cute. So we can bring some purple ones of these. They're not really bullet points, but they work. So I think these all set down here since we have that purple way above. Like that. I have to go back to Hobby Lobby and check and see if they have any more of these sticker books like this because this, like I said, this box sticker book came in really handy. Let's see if I can get this one down. I haven't been to Hobby Lobby in uh, at least a month, I guess. Might be longer than that, but it has been a while. Oh, let's see what other color we have. We have gold and black. I don't think I want to bring the black in though. So these are the only bullet points they had. I didn't want to pull in the green, but I may switch this box. Maybe I'll put a pink box there. Let's put a pink box there. And then that way, ooh, this is a big one. That way I can put the green ones up top. Actually, it still works. I'm trying to get it as close as possible there. Okay, that works. We'll leave that there. And then I can bring these green ones. Whoops, wrong tool. And put them up here. Only because I already put those other ones down and I didn't have any other color other than green in these. Okay, there's that. That looks cute. And maybe, well, see, if I put something here, the only other color of those I have is black. Unless I move the purple up and put, the, put some more greens down here. Let's try that. So I do want something here. I wish there was more colors in these. Okay, and then we'll just put some more greens down here. Whoops. Uh-oh, did you see what I did? I try to use the same page, but I did take those greens from a different page. So let's just go back. Well, we already pulled these greens, so let's just pull these. I like to use the same page when I take the stickers from them, but I wasn't paying attention there. Oh, this is coming out so cute. Okay, there's the bullet points. And then we still have these florals. So maybe one of these florals I can bring in and put here. Now let's put this little red color one. It's a pink actually. Yeah, we'll put that one there. And then I have a yellow one. I'm thinking maybe this yellow one I can set here in the middle. Oh, I could set it there. Yeah, now let's bring the yellow one to the bottom. If I can get it back out. I think I will set this one down here. Um, actually, we do need some yellow at the top. Can I set it here? Huh, let's set that one there because we do need, need yellow up there. Although now I put this one here. Do I put this one here? Ah, let's go for it. I'll set it right here. Okay. That looks cute. Okay, so I still have this. This is Pinata. Maybe I'll put this under here. I think that looks cute. Whoops. 
Okay, that looks really cute. It says Pinata. This sticker book is actually really, really cute. I can't believe I hadn't used it yet. Oh, and then we're going to put these little maracas in here. Oops, I can get them out. I think they're really cute. We'll put that one there. There's two of them. So I think I'll bring this one over here. That looks cute. And then I'm not quite sure what this is. It just has a heart and a little floral. So I'm going to bring that and set it here by her. Yeah, that looks cute. Oh, I probably should wipe this one out. Whoops. Because I'm not going to be able to use it. So might as well wipe it out. That looks really cute. And we have all these fruits here. I may bring those in. Oh, and look at the little birds. Let's see how, how does this go. We have this one too. I think this one I'm going to bring over to this side. Set it. Hmm. Maybe I can set it here with this. Yeah, I think that looks cute. And then we have these little tiny, tiny birds or butterflies. Aren't they so cute? I'm going to bring that one. And put it right there. Yeah, I really do love this book. And I can't believe I haven't used these stickers. Oh, what's going on here? I'm, I'm trying to pull this, this little thing off. But I don't know if it's not cut right. Let's see what I can do. Oh, there it is. It is one big sticker. No wonder I couldn't get it off. At least I think it is. Struggling here, guys. Struggling. Nope, it's not. Okay. This is a little bird with a little floral. So I think I'm going to set it right here on this, on this box like that. So it doesn't look funny just sitting in the air somewhere. And this bird right here is flying. So I think this one I'll put up by her. Like that looks cute. And then we have this little, looks like a rooster. No, it's not a rooster, it's some kind of bird. So I think this one I'm gonna set down here. This is pretty here. So like a little, a little tab. Just trying to decide where I want to put it. I think I'm going to set it right here with this. Just so I can make a note of some sort. Or should I put it this way? Let's put it this way. Like right there. And then I can write something there. This is coming out really cute. I think I'm just going to add in this like little decor here. So I'm going to add in the avocado because we know guacamole i don't know that's not an avocado that's a papaya it looks like a papaya here's the avocado we're going to add that avocado here and then you have a kiwi you have a lemon let's bring the lemon over here and kiwi orange i don't know what this is a pineapple let's bring the pineapple in i think that would be cute We'll put the pineapple over here, like that. And now I'm just thinking, I already have these in here, but maybe I'll bring these to the other side just to give it some extra flair, like maybe here. Yeah, let's put that one right there. That looks cute. And then we'll just bring this last one in. Since I have those there, maybe I'll put this one I could put it there. I don't, whoops, as a piece of sticker. I was just going to say, I could put it here. I don't need to know Monday and Tuesday, but look, now that just worked out. It was because of that sticker piece. I love the way this one turned out. Do I need anything here? I'm going to bring this little floral and just set it right there because I think it looks cute. And then I think I'm going to bring in this little thing to set it here. So I can make a, I can make it a little note of something there and then we have one maraca there you know what i'm going to move this one i'm going to put this one here 
and I'll show you guys why, because I want to put this one up here where it says errands. And if I put the other one, it would have been pink and pink. So we'll put this one here. I'm trying to see if that's straight. I will have to wipe this one out too. Okay, that looks cute. Now, do we want anything else in here? I have this little thing. I think I'm going to set it right. Oh, maybe I'll set this right here with this little thing. There we go. Okay, guys, I think that's going to be it because I think, I think that's everything. I'm going to leave these. There's just a few more stickers, but I think it came out good. Maybe I need a box here. I don't want a green one though. So, oh, you know what? We have yellow in here. I don't think I have any yellow boxes though. They're gold. Okay, let's maybe bring a pink box in with this. Let's see what color did I use? Maybe one of these. Yeah, let's try it. I used that other pink one. So let's bring this pink box in here and then we will be done. Yep. Oh, you know what? Should I put that on the bottom? No, we'll leave it like that. So that's it, guys. That is my spread for the week. We got to do a plan with me. You got a little fun fact about me. So I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Thanks so much for watching. I hope you guys are having a great start to your May. I hope you guys have a great week. And if you're celebrating Cinco de Mayo, don't forget to be safe. Stay creative, be gracious, and I will plan again with you soon.